This is why the narcissist is obsessed with you. This is why you fill their mind continually and to a troubling extent. This is why they are constantly talking and worrying about you. This is why they keep thinking about you and find it difficult to think about anything else. The narcissist targeted you because they believed you were innocent or naive. They could see that you were going through a difficult time. They could see that you were not responsible for or directly involved in an event yet suffering its consequences. You showed a lack of experience, wisdom or judgment. And that is what attracted them to you. It's not just about your physical appearance, money, status or power. For a narcissist to really show an interest in you, you have to come across as someone who is innocent or naive. Someone who doesn't fully understand what is about to happen. Someone who doesn't know how to deal with certain situations. That is what gives them the ability and control, which they can then use to take advantage of you. You were trustful. You had total belief in their reliability, truth or ability. You were free of distrust or suspicion. And all of these traits were really attractive to the narcissist. It's what made them want to pursue you. It's what made you stand out. But the reason why they became so obsessed with you is because these traits made you seem real. These traits made you seem genuine and authentic because you were natural and unaffected by any previous situations. You had not learned or altered your attitude towards these types of people. You remained cooperative. You remained willing to comply and assist them towards a common goal. And in their minds, that made you real. That made you genuine and authentic. Narcissists are always looking for what they don't have or what they are not. And they are not real. They have a false image or false self. which they use to trick you and lure you into the relationship. To make you believe that you shared common interests or ideas. And they had to do this because they always need to have someone real around them. They have to target someone who they believe to be real Many narcissists surround themselves with other people who are fake and it's very boring for them. It's no fun for them to target someone 
who isn't even real. It's no fun. Because there's no real emotion. When they targeted you, they could feel your genuine emotions. They knew that your emotional state and reactions were real. They knew that they were coming from a real place inside of you. Rather than something that was just artificially manufactured to produce a desired result. And that made it more exciting for the narcissist. To know that there were real feelings involved. Narcissists love emotions and reactions because that is something that they don't get to experience. It doesn't occur naturally within them because they abandoned who they really are a long time ago and created a false image or false self. But these emotions and reactions really fascinate them. It really attracts their strong attention and interest. even if it's just for a moment it makes them feel alive it makes them feel like their false self is real and that is why narcissists enjoy arguments that is why they like to hurt you Because then they get to see your reactions. They get to see how it makes you feel. And it makes them feel alive. That is why they enjoy movies. Especially drama. Because it represents things in a way that is accurate and true to life. That is why they enjoy being around children. Because children also lack experience. Their emotions and reactions are natural and unaffected. All of these things make them feel alive. And they saw these things within you. You made them feel alive. You made them feel real. And that is why the narcissist is obsessed with you. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at narcsvivorcoaching at gmail.com. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you soon.